guys, welcome to Saturday. We are starting out today getting things organized, just like most of you guys probably are, unless you're really lucky and you're at a horse show. Sophie and I are cleaning Miss Trixie's cage, so we decided to go new wave, crisp, clear. I don't even know any decorating terms, you guys. New wave. We're going fresh. She's trying to climb Clean. up the back. Is she trying to climb up the back? So basically, Whenever we put our crickets in, they can hide behind stuff and she can never get it. So we decided to put her rock <laughs> in the middle. She's peek -a Yeah, she's like, whoa, what is happening? There's her salad and her vitamins for today. And she's already eaten a lot of crickets, but there are a lot of crickets roaming around. And a fly. Yeah, flies jump in there. Anyways, welcome to today's video. I hope you guys are having an awesome Saturday. We're getting ready to go out because I am feeling restless and bored and lonely. I miss my family. I miss my friends. Like, COVID really messed everything up. I feel like nobody does stuff like we used to do stuff. But anyway, we're going out. I'll show you where. We're waiting for Gabby. She likes it that she can like move between stuff. Here, I have an idea. Let's let's take the light off again. Alright, so we made a change. Luckily for us, we have a lot of stuff for Trixie's habitat. So, oh, she's like, wow, what is this? So, I don't know, hopefully this will work out. Hopefully she'll like this. So this is, uh, it'll take her up higher too if she wants to. There's different levels. To, oh, she's like, I'll just have some salad. <laughs> she's the cutest little thing. Oh, we love her. Like, we absolutely love her. So she's a little over a year. Uh, bearded dragons are full grown at around a year and a half. We didn't celebrate her birthday? We did not celebrate her birthday. Oh. She's a little piggy. She just ate okay. so many. She likes green stuff best. Why are there she legs? She ate so many crickets. See those vitamins and supplements that we give her? She eats it. Oh, she doesn't like it. She's like, ew, I don't like that one. It's got medicine on it. Hmm, I always wondered if she minded. She knows. Unless it sinks too. Alright, Casey. She, you can't help it, she's thirsty. Oh, she's smart, she sees. So this is it, this is her new setup for the week. We'll see if it works better. She's got her water, her cave, her rock with another cave and then a sunning, sunning thing. And if you guys don't like dragons, bearded dragons, and you had to look away, then I feel sorry for you because all God's creatures have a place in the choir. Some sing low, some sing higher. That's a song. <laughs> but I believe in that song. I used to sing it to my boys when they were little. Because everybody is valuable in this world. Even people who don't sing really high and really loud, like the introverted people and the quiet people. And the anxious people, everybody's got a place in the choir. Neurodiversity, that's what I've been learning about you guys. Neurodiversity. So even bearded dragons have a place in the world. Right? Right, Trixie? Anyway, welcome to today's video. We love you guys. We love being here with you guys. We love making videos for you guys. And I just wanted to tell you guys that, that you're important and that we believe in you, that I believe in you. So go out there and be your best. No matter what anybody else says. Cheese shoes. Every equestrian and needs these shoes. Why? She's walking in mud in them. Oh my <laughs> goodness. Let's show them. I do not know whose video this is. Me either. It's on TikTok. It's on TikTok. Cheese shoes. That is weird. Like they're cool. They're weird. I like them a lot. It is gorgeous outside today. Absolutely amazing. Like a spring day. Like where the heck is, where the heck did winter go? Gabby thinks it sucks outside. Gabby with the green pocket. Oh. It is gorgeous. It's her new phone case. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I actually hate these fields. Every day my horse goes out in the morning and she goes as far as she can. And I swear to God, my girl knows. I have food, Willa. That far away is where it's at so you don't get caught. Caught.
hot. Hey, Pan, you ready to roll? Caught. Well, something special about Penny that I have never really shared with you guys that makes me incredibly happy is that if she takes a step and she feels my foot in front of her, like you know how sometimes horses step on your feet? She feels my foot in front of her, she pulls back. She pulls back so that she never steps on me. And it happens a lot because we walk close together. And when we're walking through the field, I don't know why, but I've always got my feet in front of her and she tries to never step on me. Oh man. Just like two weeks ago, this girl would stop and eat grass every time I walked her. Every time. Seems like I'm not making much progress, not making much progress. But look at you guys, progress. I mean, she already knew how to do that. I'm untrained her to do that, but I've retrained her to do that. Sam's on a tax sale. You guys know how much we love a good tax sale. And we're driving here and Gabby says, hey, isn't this the place where we went to try Chino? And it is. This is not where he was born and bred and raised. This is where he was moved to be sold. And then a day later. We and then a day later, we took him. That was the field that I like a barn. Him. Do you like a barn like the that? Look, it's half a barn. Sam just asked me, like, there. What, what's your favorite kind of barn? Tell me in the comments. Like, this barn is beautiful inside. It's got a really nice barn, and then it's attached to an arena like this, the kind that we ride in right now. So uh, the arena that we ride in right now, that's like that big red one with the, with the like tent kind of top. It, the thing that's nice about it is that it's warm. Is it warm? It lets in a lot of light, so I like that. It's not warm. It's not warm. What are you guys looking for today at this tax sale? Um, anything. Fiona keeps telling us to get, uh, you know, a breastplate, and I keep on trying for to, who? for Chino and for Finn. She wants them to both have a breastplate. But the I problem can't is, show them that, so no. well, I never can, like, I don't know how to buy one. I don't know, like, do, what size do they come? I don't know. I have to go and look at them. It's Unless I know what it is, or I don't know. Anyway, we're going to go look and see what we can find. No. So here's what the barn looks like, you guys. It's like a barn in the front, and then in the back, it's got this big, huge arena, which we, I like it. Like, it's too small of a barn, though. No, the barn is huge inside. So I need a new blanket for Willow. I think this is a just a rain sheet. I don't know. So there's a cuter one over here. Maybe it's heavier. <gasps> yeah, I like this one. But I need like she's chubby. Check the size, Sam. Mom. What? I found what you're looking for, but Western. Oh well, does it matter? Yes, it does. Let's see what size is it. It's a. Uh, this is a 66. That's not going to fit her. She's like a 48. And that is a breastplate. But we need an English one. I know. We need an English one. But it's nice. It's got nice things padding. And the reason for a breastplate is to let your saddles inside. Yeah. yeah. Alright, let's keep going. I love this. And it's only $280. Look at this. I love this. Look at I want this. Sophie wants it too? It's an 18 inch. It's treeless. I want a treeless set of. You don't have to screw on, so. Yeah, I like those. All oh, the dogs keep coming to Gabby. There was like a mini Australian Shepherd. This is an old Chihuahua. Huge Chihuahua. Shedding They're cute. But why do they run right to Gabby? It's so weird. Because she smells like a dog. The girl that showers all the time. You're adorable. Look at it shake. <laughs> Where did you come from? Is it a bridle? Yeah, it's a halter bridle like you have. It's just really dirty, but mm -hmm. it could be maybe cleaned. Oh, I want this one. Is it cob? Is it a cob size? I don't know. It's a trail, trail, yeah, no. combination. Nope. Yeah, I like it. It's adorable. I'll find out if it's cob size. There's a green one. There's a there? green one too. So this one looks way smaller than the green one. Yeah, because this is probably. Oh, that one has reins, and this one does not have reins. This one has reins? Yeah, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking over here to see if I can figure out what the heck are our training forks. Probably we don't need those, right? Training forks? 
cribbing collar. Nope, don't need that. So I also really want like a new saddle pad, Western yeah. saddle pad. It's a cob size. All right, yeah, well I we. Want it for free. Yeah. It's only $10. Yeah, I like it. Please. I like it. It's similar to mine. Lots more saddle pads. I really want a nice one. I like that one over there. Purple saddle pad. But look at all the bits. These are fancy. So we love that barn and we didn't buy anything. Sophie really liked this bridal combination thing that I have, but it's like a trail bridal and we didn't buy it because it was really dirty. What we really should have done is join that sale and brought all our extra stuff because we have a lot of extra stuff. Well, I love a good tax sale, that was fun. We didn't buy anything. I really wanted to find a blanket for Gracie, I want a pink blanket that's size 40, six or 48. Gracie, not Gracie. I want a pink blanket for Willow that's a 46 at least. Maybe, yeah, 46 or 48. That's what I need. All right, we are down in the barn, hitching our ponies. Where's my pony? Look, we cleaned this arena so good yesterday, and now there's poo. Hi, Pin. Look at how cute you are. Oh, you want to go? She wants to go. She is a mess, though. All right, so yesterday I put all this stuff in here nice and neat, tucked it who all away. That? Yeah, I wonder who did it? Who did Penny. it? She has a problem yeah. with pushing things. Our horses, I get bored. Okay, once again, it's all packed away nice and neat. Which it probably won't be tomorrow. Which it won't be tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on there, Pen. She's like, I want to go. Even if you don't ride your horse, but you just bring them in and groom them, it's like, they love it so much. It keeps them in good shape. And, whoa, look at that. Dirty belly pen. And it keeps them healthy, I feel like. A groomed horse is a loved horse. These are my favorite grooming gloves. No, nothing grooms as well as grooming gloves. Or you can get these ones at the tax store and they're amazing. Right, Penny Pickle? She loves them, all the horses love them, and when I have to use like a regular brush, it bothers me. You got the tangular spray. I, I'm, I'm doing Willow's tail. And then I'm gonna brush her. How are you doing, Gracie? She be looking cute. She has the only name I know, we need to get our brushes together and take some to the barn and bring some here. And the other thing I like about these gloves is that especially like when you have both of them on, you can go like this and cup their legs and really give them a good brush. I know some people say never brush their legs. It, but when you massage their legs like that and rub them, it helps get all the blood flowing to their legs, <laughs> to their feet, which is important. She doesn't really love getting groomed, getting her feet picked. She's the easiest, I think. You think she's the easiest? I think she's the hardest. Why do you think she's the easiest? Okay, clearly you do not know our horses. Clearly, I do. No, when the farrier comes, she's the worst behaved. Mm -hmm. I think Willow's the best behaved. She just doesn't like the farrier. No, what Penny is the best behaved. No, you're just saying that because you know the horses. <laughs> All right, you just walk toward her foot. She's gonna be like, she doesn't know anything about you. You're doing the wrong one first. Mom, you should train her until she. All right, the other side. Yeah. The other side. But she knows that you don't do her feet. She's gonna lift it up. Oh, oh, almost. Girl. <laughs> now walk to the back. Walk to the back. Walk to the back. <laughs> she lifts it up herself. Oh, girl, you just know he needs to know how to do it the right way. And she's like, give me a treat now. <laughs> I did a trick. <laughs> I'll get you a treat. Here, Mom, come here. I'll show you my pony. All right, let's see. Get Sophie's pony. Pick up your foot. What? It's a good pony. All right, that was not that good. Well, she's almost good, but not as good as mine. All right, show us yours, Gabby. <laughs> Briber. Well, I can do her feet. Alright. Oh, alright. But if you, the longer you hold hers up. Alright, well she doesn't seem as bad now, but trust me. My horse you can hold hers up for a long time. 
<laughs> She's so cute. Well, it's not like holding her feet up. No holding it herself. <laughs> <laughs> Last time I rode a penny outside, she did this weird thing two times where she tossed her, she put her head down. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Do you know grass? No, I don't think it was to eat grass. I don't yeah, know. Like, no. Yeah, that one. Anyways, you know how when you know your horse, you know your horse. But she's been off, so I don't know, like, if something changed or what the heck. But anyways, I feel like, I don't know. I want Gabby to ride her and see if she does it with Gabby. But I don't know if it was because of the boots and she's not used to them because I haven't, like, really walked her outside with those boots on. Or if it's just, I don't know what it was. It was weird. Something I've never really seen her do before. So I'm gonna have Gabby ride her around without the boots and see if she does the same thing and just see if it was like, what the heck it is. Because Sophie and I are the kind of people that like, we can't even begin to like, think about riding our horse unless we know that they're feeling good. Oh, look at Willow's beautiful tail. Willow. Have such a beautiful butt. Tail. Tail. <laughs> Sorry, is it rude to say that to horses? You have a beautiful butt, but look at how nice it is. Like, beautifully. I know, he's so cute. Yeah, it's <laughs> only right here that's not so cute. So the reason I didn't buy Gabby, Sophie, that green bridle today that's like this, blue, or the green one, is because I, it was like old. And I don't know, I didn't like it as much. I think I'm just gonna maybe buy her buy her one. But I like how this kind of bridle you can use a bit or you okay. cannot use a bit. What is this hook on to? There's this thing or this thing? That. This? I think so. Alright. I was confused. We don't know. Well, we were at that sale today, there were a bunch of Western stirrups, but I didn't like them. They were just this pretty much why. exactly like this. I need yeah. another helmet. There you go. She's looking at me like, really? So really, Laura? You're going to make her? You guys remember when I first bought her and we brought her here, I dreamt that she talked to me. Okay, yeah, I'll walk around with you. Right. Sophie, you go with her. So we're just, we just, uh, we're just a walking family right now. <laughs> she looks really pretty though. I love watching her walk. There's birds everywhere, cars everywhere. Feet, raindrops falling on the street. I can't recall when I last saw the sun. Summer's just a memory, a faded piece of history. No one can remember all the fun. The late night barbecue, zipping on a genie juice. I never shy away from a good time Coming on Friday night I see my friends and feel alright There ain't no stopping us from having fun So that's the thing about Penny is that she only ever takes like one or two tries before she figures out, okay, this is what you want from me, and then she just adapts, and and that's one of the reasons that I like her. She's so easy to manage, and it might not come across like that in the videos. I don't know, 
Or maybe it comes across like I'm over exaggerating everything. I don't even know about that. All I know for sure is that I love her and I feel like I can ride her. So uh, the next time I ride, now that I know she's okay, the next time I ride her, I'll ride her myself without uh, try without somebody walking me. Good girl, Penny Pickle. Good girl, I love you. And she's like, oh, take more treats then. <laughs> I love you too. I love you too, Gracie. I love you all. The one thing that I do know for sure is that there are a lot of women, a lot of girls, a lot of people out there loving their horse, wanting to do their best by their horse and being afraid and having confidence issues. I know that it happens to a lot of people and I know it happens to everybody at some point or another. If you haven't got there yet, you will get there and if you are there, you will get through it. And every step, every step that you take to conquer your fear is a step in the right direction. So slow and steady. I'll walk her in the next two times and then the next, the third time, I will ride her up that hill again. Don't you know that you're beautiful?